I know I speak for everyone here today when I say that I am greatly inspired by these very distinguished alumni. If I may take a moment, the university wants to commend each of our inductees for their exceptional athletic careers at CUA. Think of this. Many in this room, many of us in this room, are either current or former college student athletes. But I think what I'm going to try to get across, I really do believe it resonates with everyone here, regardless of if you played a sport in college. So when our playing days conclude, and really whenever some sort of significant chapter in someone's life comes to a close, inevitably, many of us will self-reflect and ask, did I make a difference? Did my contribution matter? Well, Jeff, John, Tony, Chris, Brent, during your time at CUA, you most certainly mattered. But you didn't just make a difference. You were the difference, exhibiting remarkable levels of athleticism, dedication, competitive savvy, toughness that not only led to countless victories and accolades, but as we've discussed, helped establish a level of possibility for future Cardinal student athletes. Each of you is so clearly deserving of this special honor. You are now officially amongst the very best of those who ever set foot on this campus to study and, of course, pursue the sport that they love. So I do want to say it this way. Welcome to your Hall of Fame. Congratulations. I love football. I love this university. I love my teammates. I love my family. I love my classmates, coaches, and friends. This entire occasion is the culmination of all of these people influencing or affecting my life, making this incredible honor possible. I really, I really hit my stride here at Catholic. This place was simply majestic during my time here with my guys. It was very unique as well. Many of my teammates and coaches were rivals in high school as we competed against each other in a very prestigious Washington Catholic Athletic Conference. Also, Jeff, uh, last night we had a great dinner, and uh, uh, Jeff Clay put it best. He goes, man, if if uh, all these new buildings and all these new stores and restaurants and Starbucks and, you know, if they were around when we were, I don't know if we would have gone to class. <laughs> right? Perfect quote. I'm extremely humbled to be standing up here today among some of the tremendous athletes, the Hall of Famers, and the contributors to Catholic University. It is certainly nice to be recognized for the event, and I'm thrilled to be back on campus here with my family, my friends, my coaches, administrators. However, I recognize that I wouldn't be you know, standing here today without the many influences on my life. What a great experience Catholic U was for me. The best thing that happened to me here, I think, is I met my future wife, um, who's a 93, class of 93, Jen Douglas. Right answer, that's the right that, that is the right answer. <laughs> I'd like to thank the university. I'd like to thank President Garvey. I'd like to print, uh, thank the alumni board and anybody else. Thank you very much. I, I, I got to let you know this is the absolute highlight of my athletic career. Sit down. Catholic opened the door, and I just had to walk through it. And Catholic gave me so many more opportunities. While I was here, the staff, the coaching staff, the faculty, friends, family, it really was an amazing place to be. And this honor tonight, it is so special because I think it's a testament to where hard work can take you. And so there are hundreds of you that I'd like to thank tonight. Um, the Talbots have been here all the way. My family, my mom for making me play volleyball. Coach Nagy for just the belief that he put in me. I mean, imagine his first year coaching. He walks to a team with three girls. He had to have a lot of belief to stick around. I really uh, owe this to uh, the late Coach Cal uh, for uh, mentoring me and coaching me uh, for the four years that I was here. Um, he was really um, an amazing leader. Uh, I, you know, still emulate those uh, leadership qualities, I think, today, um, you know, in my current professional role, um, as well as, you know, sometimes with my own family, much to their uh, annoyance. But, um, you know, he was also a, um, a, a fierce um, advocate for our, you know, our program and our, you know, our recognition and our well-being, um, as well as Bob Talbot, who, who stood with him during that time. 
Um, you, you know, I don't always take myself that seriously, and um, you, you know, this is just such an honor. Um, you know, I'm grateful for the entire, um, you know, community for for giving me this this honor and this. Opportunity.